In this tutorial, I'll show you how to clone your voice and cap card just so you can use it as TTS or test to speech feature. All right. That way, all you have to do is create a test or use your article or your story and test, copy, paste it, and just use that voice to create a voiceover. So first I have to insert a test. I'll go up here, top left, click on test. All right. So the default test, click on the plus sign to insert, click on test to speech. But in case you want more subtitles or features, just click on the arrow sign here. It's hard to see, but there's an arrow there. All right. So click on test to speech. All right. So right here, custom voices. That's if you want to use the, the AI voices, I'll click on it. All right. So these are the AI voices that you can use from CapCut, but that's not what we want. I want to create my own. All right. So now I have to click on create. So see, so create your custom voice with 10 seconds of audio. So this is the test you will have to read. So before you click record, which is this one, just go through the test and read it to yourself three times, just so you know what you are dealing with. Now, the reason why you have to read this two or three times as you can tell right here distance you see the e is right here it, it cuts all right so when you read it you get to know all right and there's another one see right here the still so st then the i l l is cut all right so and also adventure a is here and the adventure is here i don't know why CapCut cannot rectify or fix this all right so now when you are ready just click here and start reading all right so now i'm gonna click record and make sure you have your microphone all right so as you can tell right here i have my microphone headphone adapter It's because i have a, a microphone and i've connected through a microphone adapter that's why it says adapter instead of saying the name of the microphone all right so i'll start a sound of a train whistle in the distance a lonesome call that cuts through the still night air evokes a sense of travel and adventure that stays the imagination all right so now it's just creating it all right so it says i should listen to my voice but because i'm recording this video for tutorial i cannot so i'll just uh rename this let's see GMV. I'm just trying to name it something. GM Vocal. All right. And it says, I think up to eight characters you can type. And what I'll do, I'll save it. Normally, it's your voice, whether you're listening to it or not. So I'll click on save. It's save here. So I'm going to try and create a test. All right. So I'll use it to create a voiceover. So first, I'll click on it. How will you be charged for custom voices? You will be charged by a number of characters. Read with custom voice one ready to score to 25 characters it's a free to listen to the custom voice it will only be charged after an audio clip is generated with a custom voice you will get 24 credit or when you use custom voices for the first time let's let me see generate the test generating speech i don't even have anything really so let me see default text all right so you guys can hear it but i cannot hear it so i'll try again default text so it's just reading the all right so i'll try and type something all right so now i'm gonna create a new voiceover so create project click on test because this will be test to speech or voiceover so so click on the plus sign to insert all right now i'm gonna go over here to paste my test and this to speech all right and i'm gonna use this okay so credit left 700 credit needed for this seven credit so generate speech it's generating credit will be consumed applying custom voices will consume seven credit you have seven credit left all right so apply let's see okay this test gave me 11 seconds so let me play it my avatar for the introduction to a youtube video let the gestures match with the text naturally generate a realistic image of an american male in a podcast studio that's how you clone your voice and use test to create a voiceover i hope you like it all right so this is the end of the tutorial thanks for your time please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this channel